Good evening everyone, I'm Elerion and welcome back to Kaiserreich Indochina. Last time we left we have just begun the revolution or the uprising against the colonial power of Germany. Alright, so now we're, it's time to actually start the war. I noticed that from the deployment of our troops we have uh, forgotten three uh, main units that exist here. So we're going to railroad them up north. So they are quickly going to overrun before the uh, German East Asia could bring uh, reinforcements to the mainland of Indochina. It is going to be critical importance that we protect our ports. So here and here, as we are going to have constant naval invasions, I think there is an event or a decision if Saigon, ha if the area around Saigon is has been uh, uh, invaded, you can uh, spawn some div some divisions. But we hope we are not going to get to this point. So let's go over the national spirits. Sorry, that we get in the beginning of the actual campaign as, as Indochina. Uh, is an easy union. First of all, we are a, go a gorilla, gorilla tradition. We have a gorilla army, uh, something that actually uh, is a very famous um, part of the of the Vietnam War. Um, yeah, you actually, I think we got over that uh, in in the last episode, if I'm not mistaken. Viet Minh, poorly organized army, and apathetic people. We don't have the control of the people or the support yet. So. Alright, let's start. And uh, we're gonna play in speed two. I don't think we need anything else. We have we don't have any any actual uh military factories. We hope to gather some. Alright <coughs> sorry. A new Indo China a general uprising has achieved the great victory. On the corpse of the, con of the German colonial regime proudly stands our independent nation ruled by the Vietnamese National Independence Coalition, or Viet Minh. Sorry. Uh, which, was, which was established earlier this year, in which coordinated the uprising. Nguyen has been elected as the chairman of Viet Minh. The, the loss of thousands of lives have already proven that the German colonial regime will not yield until the bitter end. Anyway, what it actually says we have a coalition government, and so we uh, add up, I think, the, the popularity of the ruling parties. We will be victorious. So we get a bonus opinion with uh, France and with the Bahari Commune. The and uh, in we have international support, international declaration, of independence. All right. So, what kind of, what kind of uh, declaration of independence are we to? As a national, cell, as a national salvation war against German bandits begin, we are going to form an independent sovereign state. So, we could go for international uh, declaration, which is pretty much uh, radical socialists and totalists. Uh, a pan-Asianist declaration and then a moderate declaration. What does the moderate declaration actually? Um, uh, in the text. So we could go for pan-Asianist or international declaration. That's very interesting. I haven't decided what part of the focus is I'm going to play. I generally t tend to play more syndicalist countries but uh, it's right now probably the an, an anarchist evolution <laughs> expand the social evolution modern culture interesting so we could go either for an internationalist I think I'm between an internationalist and a syndicalist declaration the Moderate. I think I'm gonna go for the internationalist declaration 
because it's not really a big decision it doesn't not give a lot of boost but it is um, going to give us general opinion with all of the syndicalist nations no does Russia exist no it, Soviet Russia doesn't exist anyway let's continue I think we get a field marshal at some point right you are going to reach here and quickly spread out so we are spreading in all directions trying to cut off an, as much as we can before they arrive we have the do, do we have i think we are okay from weapons we are missing about not a lot of equipment so we could actually train one division I think, uh, yes in the nationalist declaration of independence yes uh, it, uh, it just repeats the role the lore we have uh, talked in the previous episode uh, the no division we can actually train two so no I'll oh, have more decisions intensify harassment no form so I could lose I <coughs> sorry so I'm going to lose some uh, weapons and I'm going to gain two units in uh, 60 days I'm gonna spend some political power, organize no, no support our troops. That's good, but not yet. This is just going to give me some um, radical socialists, so n nothing right now. Well, we haven't yet. Ooh, what happened? Oh, selling of S Saigon. Uh, where, where, where are you going? Uh, wait, where are my two? had two um you no you are here I don't know, just delete give me a second you are going to defend this right so now you can you're gonna be added here and move towards the back and there is technically one more one one extra Ah, yeah. this guy which needs to be added here and actually <coughs> <coughs> sorry no, back to the event the sailing of Saigon the, this morning the German began bombarding the city of Saigon using both German warships as well as aerial bombardment when the assault finally ceased most of the major buildings of in Saigon had been ba basically leveled this will drive the people against the Imperial Germans. The Imperial Germans. Uh, move this to the top. Actually, the, this doesn't really matter because we can actually move this to the top. It's, we don't have anything to produce. Uh, also, make a general attack. Oh, I do have an attack order. Uh, so, activate so they just move. Uh, no, you move here. Actually, you don't move here. Railroad to the top. So we can actually advance as quickly as possible to the German border and actually capture some of Siam. I might be making the actual uh, uprising quite more quite easier than it, it should be because I don't I, I kept the troops down here but we'll see all right uh, you are going to rush up there through the the actual parlors you two are going to actually stay here and defend the actual um <coughs> sorry port all right the G a German blockade so we can uh all right so the Germans imperialists have completely cut off our lines of communication with our international friends now we're in the dire lacking of equipment many of our soldiers 
are equipped with hatches and spears. The tan tan viet part in Harry is the trans transnational underground evolutionary network developed by the old league in the 1920s. Alright, so we could actually create an international arms trafficking system which is going to boost a bit of the total list or we could keep the pace. We're gonna lose the international support which is pretty helpful. Mm, but uh, alright, so activate the system. It's actually useful. So we can use political power to actually, uh, uh, actually open uh, trade routes. That's the point. Uh, do I want? No, I don't have actually have any political power right now. So that's not really useful. You continue moving up there, so we can actually grab as much of this as possible. I'm guessing more. No, 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 no. Continue up there. I think there's an event if you cut if you cut here. Anyway, um, the actual uh, revolt is actually pretty easy. Oh, the politics in the Viet Minh. Sorry. Among all the revolutionary patriots in the Viet Minh, four factions stand out. After the crackdown in the 1920s, Ho Chi Minh Revolutionary Youth League suffered in from internal split. The Indian Chinese Revolutionary League is a direct successor. In, in he, adhering to orthodox anarcho syndicalists, the current leader, Ta Tu Tao, this name, re recently returned from France, succeeded in organizing the trade unions in Saigon and some of other cities. Influenced by the first Jacobin, some hardliners broke away from the League in 1931 Paris Conference and formed the New Viet, New Viet Revolutionary Party. Or Tan Viet. Tan Viet believed in the virtue of iron discipline and secret movement. As a result, they provide the proof to be to be effective in, in infiltrating the colonial policy for the uh, garrison. The VNDD, the Vietnamese National Committee, is modeled after the Chinese National Party Kim Ti. This party is popular among the petty bourgeoisie and wealthy farmers, especially in northern Vietnam. The fairy Yan Bien meeting cut down many of the party members, but also won them heroic reputations. So we ha also have uh, the Nian, this guy, a prominent anarchist revolutionary in in the center form. They space and you convinced that syndicalism cannot win the revolution. He modeled the movement additional secret societies and uh, to agitate the revolutionary so spontaneity of peasants. While Itanakis deals attacked many intellectuals, they connected to rural layers a key role to in the revolution and sued their dominance in the Viet Minh. Alright, so it is described what we have. The aspiration youth is what we are now. So it's. Alright, uh, so you have one, two, three, I think. And take it. One, two, three. And uh, you, oh, it's also, of course, the syndicalists. All right, can I get some political power now? We could go down the yeah and reach urbanization, or we could go for the extra research slot. No. This is going to, I think it's broken effect, change local mobilization to law. This can change law mobilization, so it helps. Also, we have, a, so we have four choices right now. <coughs> Sorry. We could break the chain. Uh, this is syndicalism and uh, radical socialism, incorporate administration, land policy, and education reform. Uh, if I think this is going to be quickly over, so. Right now, I think what is most important is to get um, the actual uh, research sort down here and the mobilization, the war economy. We might lose this one because we need to be at war and I don't think we're going to have a tough time. Or we might have to reach extended mobilization. Mm. I mean, I'm going to do all of them before I progress so I don't know 
Alright, I think we're gonna start with the break the chains actually. The following colonial bureaucracy is the chain that cycles our people in for millennia. We're gonna break the chains, we're not gonna incorporate them into our model. It is actually the worst choice by mile, but it's more lore friendly for what I wanna do, and I don't like incorporating colonial policies into revolutionary movements. It never worked. Well, uh, if you want to create a new system, you should smash the old one down to the brink. Now, we don't have much of uh, anything, but we can actually spawn two divisions. And I think what's more important right now is to form the new divisions from here. So, we're gonna remove some of this, and the next one is gonna open this. <coughs> Sorry. All right, um, we are moving towards uh, capturing the middle of the country so we can create a bottleneck that the enemy cannot, under any circumstances, break. Or we hope he can't. This guy is over. No, you, you, you do that, and all of you follow them. Uh, all right, all right. So no, get this. It's uh, moving. Alright, I think speed four might be even be acceptable right now. Alright. Oh yeah. Um, Alright, so we have the citizen Viet Vint When the troops are marched in the Imperial capital, the Vietnamese Emperor Bao Dai persuaded by agent stayed H had been to stay had been waiting to his citadel. Today, in the platform in front of the few, few surrounded by an enthusiastic crowd in the flying in Germany, red flag, the Emperor bought announced. From this day on, royalty is abolished in Vietnam. Emperor Bai Dai is from here on a simple citizen. Viet Thai citizen this name. Citizens, let me be understood. I pretend to be prefer to be a free citizen than an enslaved king. <coughs> so the emperor actually uh, abdicated, giving us some political power, and so we can actually open the smuggling and lock the make, make or river, so you can actually smuggle um, from other countries from here. All right, and we could keep up to increase the economy. So we, the fate of of Thin Nam. Nam is a very successful merchant in northern Vietnam, known as the Queen of Iron. She is also owned some of the largest, most modern plantations in the north. She has been secretly funding the anti colonial movement for a long time. However, while La Armis has advanced, the workings in her plantations rose up and captured her. They, along with over 5,000 peasants from neighboring communes, come together and set up a revolutionary tribunal. Under the REM banner, overthrow the despotic landlord, take back the land of the peasants. That's correct. Now the death penalty for here. I thought stop the execution, but an imminent decision needs to be made. So, it, th we have a, it's a very interesting actual political decision. Where does the revolution stand on its benefactors? You have a plantation owner, that has actually helped fund the revolution. But if we, but uh, the peasants that he actually worked to death, so he used his political position to advance the cause. It's a good thing. But he also worked through within the system and was part of the, of the problem. So we could. <laughs> Uh, call her a hero, save her, and we get some social democracy. We could confiscate her property and leave her be, and revolution the scene for justice and kill her. Pretty much. The In the last, we don't actually get her as a minister. And I think she's. Uh, I don't actually know what she sees. Mm, I don't think there's an easy way to find out. Anyway, we are going to confiscate her property and leave her be because right because he, she has committed crimes under the capitalist system, but uh, her help for evolution has been paid for her crimes. Just see, her property cannot stay in her, her own hands. 
delete things all right and you want to all right all right co come on continue going up things and we are going to advance no I don't want to be moving here I want them to be moving here come on no 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 you don't sit around you push we need to reach as farthest up seems that we can uh, we could form a new brigade right here from the the Laos brigade Sabota of Northern Vietnam Alright, so we're gonna sabotage Northern Vietnam and we are form from now. <coughs> I think that helps pretty much this is gonna help um, if you open the land connection and then you could after five days it's an uprising. So we're gonna open the Tang Song Trail. Great. Uh, uh this is moving t quickly towards um, the top side of the map anyway Yanan sends rifle mention as we face them as many citizen forces our nation the Yana clique has l long been safe haven for sympathizers from the Chinese and the Belize crusade has said to send us rifle shipment so we are Yanan uh, isn't this Yanan? Oh, so he's going for the bastion of republicanism. Interesting. Thank you, Yanan. That's pretty helpful, actually. Thank you. Support our troops. We're not actually fighting yet. I'm actually going to be very disappointed if we reach up there without this. Uh, hmm, this is the KMT is here. Social demos. The KMT has. I think they isn't uh, GNT anyway. All right, we have our first uh, problems. Yeah, they are arriving here. Let's see if we can actually encircle them. You fight from there. After the failure of the Yen Ban mutiny, the fate of many v leaders has unknown. Uh, both Nicomad and the founder and head of VNC managed to escape from the German bandit persecution. He fled the mountain regions of Sino Vietnamese border and hid South China. So he returns bringing a lot of social democracy with him. Bloody hell, that's a lot of social democracy. We are forming uh, missions. Alright, so I want to intensify harassment yes once this great move there you are going to move here here and here you attack down there you three continue uh, be added here and continue moving here we want to cut off the reinforcements of the enemy if we manage to do that we're gonna be a pretty pretty good situation uh, oh so we have some occupations why is it the motorized division no just use this division the motorized division requires motorized it's not very helpful uh, keep them pinned as we m try to encircle them. Oh, and also for you. Oh, right. So, all right. So one of you is going to try and circle from here. You move here, 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 and here to cut them off. <coughs> Sorry. Anyway, the, the plan is to actually capture as much from Vietnam before the enemy can actually reorganize its forces. Alright, so we have uh, one. We can make some weapons. 
All right. And attack them. Break the chains. Thank you. Uh, anti infiltration campaign. Nearly every revolutionary organization in China has in named the spies. And undoubtedly, the enemy's agent is the revolution. I'm not quite sure what this does because I remember uh, upping uh, your conscription law or something like that. But I don't know now. Move here, attack here. Oh, you clean up uh, southern China. That's your job. Clean them up so they don't have any control of these states. And cannot, in the any circumstances, you are cut off. Attack here. Uh, I think. Move here. All of you attack here. Break them. They are cut off. They are going to be losing uh, pretty much any semb semblance of uh, organization they have. I need one of you. You are already playing there. Ooh, ah, the person panic. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a bit of a sick. A soldier have reported an uh, encountering terrible steel monsters that can split fire, split fireballs. Our officers trained in France know it. The, it is a type of armored vessel called the tank, or or in German the punja. However, this weapon is still cause great panic among the peasant soldiers. So you brought peasant against peasants tanks. Now that's a very good analog, especially, you know. In, in China. Come on, come on. Oh, so we cleaned up from this. Uh, give. Oh, did we have any? We don't have a general yet, and I'm actually pretty disappointed. Right, give me that and add them here. Alright, go. Yeah, alright. No, I don't want you to, to. I want you to relocate. You keep them there. I don't actually keep attacking them. You need to keep the pinned. Uh, you stay here and you stay here. Yes. Alright. Uh, if they are going to do that, let them. We got no problem with them doing that. <sighs> mm, you. You're. Oh. So we could <coughs> collab with the so we I'm going to collaborate with uh, a crime crime syndicate so we can smuggle better. Actually, yes. Do you know why? Because many revolutionary governments actually did that. They collaborate with. Oh no! Oh, are you? No, 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 you don't get to do that. Oh, for f oh, why am I playing in speed 4? For God's sakes. No. Alright, all of you. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Come on up here. Ah, oh, god damn it. Just cut them off. I'm quite certain we could. Alright. Move there and attack. Could we negotiate with the Germans? We could probably negotiate with the Germans pretty quickly. No, you don't move me there. You move there. You do attack. Where are you going? Uh, I wouldn't advise you. You just go cut close here alright and we're gonna be coming to reinforce this line they're not passing this river that's very simple what they're gonna have we're gonna keep this river mm. alright oh we have a, a dangerous invasion uh, give me one of these send them down here I'm pretty sure this is gonna be enough if it isn't well, we're gonna work it like it is. Do not leave. Stay. Right. Right. <coughs> okay. 
keep them pinned. <coughs> Sorry. So we are running our phone in uh, exchange, a new foreign exchange and uh, earner needed to finance the weapon. So we can lose war support. What are we actually doing? Oh, we are making cash crops. Yes, we are. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna enlist an amateur gorilla in an Ahn van Bother Literati. I think this is a famous actual general, and we are going, definitely going to get him. It is his brother. I think he's this guy. actually like this. Uh, I think, isn't he better than we want to have? So he's an even different. Actually, I think he's career officer. I like the one we have. Um, hmm. I think we are gonna promote you once I have enough points, but I don't have enough points right now. Attack back. Actually, you attack here. No, do. Right, go, come on here. This is your job. This. <coughs> Bring them down. Uh, reorganize. So, the German scam want to sabotage our glorious revolution. Spies, terror, traitors are everywhere. While the VNQDD wants to, in to infiltrate the enemy and launch an intelligent counter revolution. Counter offensive, the Tan Vien party argues that expanding our sixes police is the only way to eliminate internal enemies. So we could, we must have our intelligence, which is the Social Democrat part. We then expand the secret police, which is gonna give us lots of political power and gain encryption. Red terror is a response. Well, red terror. I mean, <coughs> to whom is it the Red Terror? Let's be very specific. Is it the Red Terror against the capitalist overlords and the German uh, German uh, colonel? Yes, of course we're going to have Red Terror against them. And also, this is the, the actual two. I want to expand a bit of the support of the actual uh, <coughs> syndicalists because the totalists are going to get a bit of things around. And this is okay. So we gain political power, resource efficiency, max factor per state. We lose some, and we gain recent growth speed. No, we're gonna use every means necessary to stop the the actual thing. All right, move here and attack. Attack here. Oh, also, uh, we're going to mobilize. And once we're done with this, I think that's just gonna give us a bit of a. More manpower, if I remember correctly. Also, you are going down here so we can actually grab some uh, of these. And you're gonna. We want to. Come on. It's gonna die, that's the trick. Right, once we, we want to fortify the actual river. So. They have a base here, so they we supply, but they are actually almost defeated right now. Where are you going? No, do, do not go there. In particular here. Come on, kill them. He just for this one. Great, this is gonna get, get up. No, yeah, so you are going to do this. And go and grab this. No, if you go here, just go this way. Oh, for fuck's sake, uh, you move here, uh, use this river instead. Uh, you stand here. So we're going to actually pretty much have constant. Oh, oh, for f fuck, fuck. Oh, oh, stop, 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 stop. I knew. No. Army reform. Ah, yes, this is gonna, what's going to unlock us, our, our army. The newly born people's army in the China has stood up for up to the baptism of fire. Right, so this is just what's gonna allow us to actually do them to choose. <coughs> uh, 
Grand Battle Plan and Mass Assault Doctrine, we're gonna go with Mass Assault, actually, for Political Officer Reform Plan or the General Staff Reform Plan. Uh, right now, I actually want to work in this because. Come on. Uh, is there an. Uh, create a base? Yes. I click haven't managed to do anything right now. From that trick, so you are quite we are quite close because you cannot actually have to invade through land, and let's be clear, that's not gonna happen. Uh, are we actually losing? No, you stay here. You come here. This is these are better units than ours, but I believe I also delete these. And all right, look, 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 you, you, um, all right, we're gonna get you two, and you're going to rush down here right now. The rest of you are uh, you are going to be added here, and you are going to be added. Actually, you're not gonna be added anywhere because I want to do all right, and you're moving there one, two, three. Add to this and go. We're going <coughs> so what we're going to do is going um, to slowly but surely. Come on. Where are you going? Just push them out from there. Also, do not, do not break stupid front lines. You move here. Try to get this so you can see in circle. You, just, just clean up the mess that's for me. they're going to oh I think they have a re repeating decision to attack they go no go help for God's sake <coughs> uh, I don't need go activity I don't need to reorganize I'm gonna get some extra division right now here we're gonna get some extra divisions and yeah I think we are in a pretty good spot right now. Oof, what happened? Oh, attack them and crap the bloody... Mm -hmm. Hold them in place so we can actually grab the bloody thing. Don't be silly. Alright, uh, uh, religious issues. You, for now, attack this. Uh, you move down and just grapple everything around. Yeah, enemy is reality. And what's that? Danger, naval invasion. And here. Anyway. Religious issues. This one is the home of millions of Buddhist, Christians, and uh, cow dice. For many years, religion played a dominant role in people's lives. With the establishment of a revolutionary government, there is these religious beliefs are on the brink of panic. Believers. So, what are we going to do with religion? We can be secularist. We could be patriots, and we are. We need to unite. Uh, so it's war support, national populism, authoritarian democracy. We could actually try to integrate the religions, or we can secretly, secretly pay No, we're gonna be a secularist country. I don't. As you see, I want the actual syndicalists to probably be in charge, and I think that's actually not. Uh, yes, uh, what else? No, you stay where you are right now. You don't have any political power. Where are you going? No, you do not actually come up here. We don't actually need you right now. And give me this guy. Attack up there. Yeah. Attack and just try to. Alright. Come on. Ex uh, extensive conscription. Yes, now we have more people. All right, great. So we're gonna go for the extra research slot now. The German colonial brought with them the any only only sausages. Oh God! I really didn't want to believe that the world here was sausages. <laughs> Millions of our uh, carpets are still illiterate, so we are going to do an education reform and uh, actually create. What's it? So we're going to use a Latin script. Interesting. 
Could we negotiate with the Germans now? I think there is a... Um, so we could actually negotiate right now and um, I think uh, it's actually pretty... I think it's, is it free? Uh, less than the standard limit, we have most of things captured. <coughs> and I don't see the reason not to negotiate with the Germans. Alright, I think negotiating with the Germans might be the right decision right now. Is there anything we need to do, we want to do locked behind being at war? Mm, I don't think so. What I wonder, anyway, let's see. Uh, Alright. Could you... Why do you st stop? Attack here, attack here. Alright. Great. Alright, so they have a pretty stable formed line right now. Once we push them out of the... <coughs> Sorry. Once we push them out of this area, we're gonna be pretty... in a pretty good position actually to defeat them. I think we are to negotiate the retreat for, for, the, for the Germans because right now they are pretty doomed. Let's see what they're gonna say. So we'll start negotiating with the Germans. We won't give up easily, taking the battlefield and enemy weakness. Susan could, could help us, of course. Yes, let's. Yes, they sent. Almost immediately. Alright. That's okay. And we still don't have any. Right, we. I want to promote you, right? With the organizer. Yes, planning spree, trickster organizer. So we need unable to promote. We need another two, three percent. So we have finished the revolution. Congratulations! Uh, I think there is an event for that. So let's go with border with the kingdom of Siam, which is social liberal. Interesting. Which is our next enemy. So congratulations, we have thrown out the yoke of the Germans. And right now we are once again a free of our outside influence nation. With only two research slots. Great. And we have stopped having panzers. Jack Reed's elected president of the United States. Oh, old Jack has been elected president. Interesting. So we are gonna have, I hope, we hope a pretty strong sh uh, CSA, uh, the actual uh, uh, revolution in America. Interesting. So let actually let me just let's just, just finish. That's what I wanted. German accepted the peace initiative and it retreat from into China Peninsula. In the Chinese Peninsula, we have. Fulfill the mission of forcing German imperialism to withdraw. In China is now liberated from the German colonial regime. This is a great victory for our people and the major defeat in German imperialists and their lackeys. So we're gaining stability. We gain stability and we gain a bit of power. Why do we have cores there? Don't we have core everywhere? <coughs> no, actually, we don't have calls in Laos, I think. Uh, we are going to use civil oversight. Yes, we, we want to actually... I think this is... We want to build a bit. This is growing. Yeah, this is growing, but we are building a plan slowly. Right, so we have social liberals here. The linear link. Paternal autocrats here. Interesting. The Kuomintang has actually proved its position. I think it was actually here that it started. Mm -hmm -hmm. Education reform, and we're gonna modify apathetic people. Great. We are actually uh, a litest campaign, so we are going to try to make our country literate. I always thought of the actual Indo Chinese Union inside of Kaiserak closer to something like. Uh, the Cuban Revolution uh, with Castro and uh, Che Guevara uh, trying to bring in uh, oh, an actual to bring uh, an actual uh, colonial um, 
nation outside outside of a uh, uh, <coughs> sorry actually bring it to the 21st century or the 20th century trying to actually modernize it make it a valve force around not really any an, an actual how do you call it um, you know not send around the army really but more uh, act around improving the lives of uh, the citizen which the Cuban revolution actually did and you can subjugate you can um, replace the United States of this world with the Jap with Japan in this one not really one on one comparison but you know you know uh, so I think that's enough for today we have won our revolt we have established ourselves as a nation and now we can prepare for the eventual war with Siam no yeah sorry World with Siam and perhaps an involvement or probably involvement either with the Chinese Civil War, the the Indian Civil Wars, or the Second World Creek. And you can see them all here. Technically we could join also the um corporate paid sphere. We don't think we can right now. If we go national populist all could be uh I think this our social democratic pact no social is not cynically aligned I think I think so we next episode we're gonna finish with this we're gonna have the national assembly and we're gonna choose which one we're gonna go uh, if you have any suggestions write it in the comments uh, I think I'm probably leaning syndicalist anyway it was has been fun uh, playing with you see you next time.